What's up, Dapper Squad? It's your boy Darius, back at it again with some more Kaguya-sama Love is War Season 3, Episodes 9 and 10, starting the Dual Confession Festival arc. Super excited that everyone have some finalization to their character arc. I mean, I can't say finalization, but we're going to have some crazy moments come up at the end of the season. I just absolutely know it. I am ready for it. Hopefully you guys are as well. If you are, please leave a like. Let me know your thoughts down below. If you want to catch these episodes early, the finale is already up. If you're watching this on YouTube, probably already in the next show, to be honest. And I know what that is, but I'm not going to tell you. Um, <laughs> make sure you guys should go check out that Patreon, early access, full length, all that jazz. I say we hop right on into this. Kaguya Sama, Love is War, Season 3, Episodes 9 and 10. Let's do this. Here we go. One year ago, spring. Oh, a year ago. It's been a week. He's brand new. Wow. Is this the previous? Yes. President. And here's where we first meet Kaguya, see her. I love how we're on opposite sides of the waterfall, the fountain. The ice princess. Yep, she no Mia. Ooh, I kind of like that reasoning. We've all been sheltered. We need some sort of outside perspective. And I love the camera work with their eyes as well. Super creative cinematography right here in this anime. Like, look at this. Just cutting up like little manga panels. Chica. Ice Queen. <laughs> it's so crazy seeing Miyuki with a completely different mindset, you know? Is the swamp safe? Diseases and stuff? Someone jump in and save her. Miyuki, <laughs> they said, is this fucking... Is this Ka Kaguya? Emotionless? Elegantly? Oh my goodness, look at her. That was well done, Miss Kaguya. Okay. Yep. I would have never known that that's what made that's what made Miyuki fall for her. Supposing people like that exist. <laughs> so that's his reasoning for wanting to become president. Just so he even feels able to stand next to Kaguya, you know? That's how amazing she is of, of a woman, you know? She no Mia. That was a great story. I can't lie. Okay, miss. You are the embodiment of a classic Japanese woman. Okay. <laughs> You're cosplaying. Even though you are. You literally look normal. You totally own that character. <laughs> That's so funny how they're playing this off. <laughs> You know, this cafe sounds quite lovely right now. I could go for a cup of joe. Jesus, they have a line. Are they here for Chica? 
I'm trying to know what I remember them from. Are those the... That's the ramen guy, right? Aha, uh -huh, these are the ramen connoisseurs. They want eye. The right motion. <laughs> she knows the answer to the universe. Oh. If you if you're that serious, okay, let's see it. Put your money where your mouth is. Right. She could have gotten away with it too and be serving Miyuki right now. She didn't have her own her ego, her pride, I should say, on the line. The way they're animated is so funny. Okay. I need to drink tea like that good. I need to start using descriptors like this. No question about it. No. Just forget anything you just saw hells yeah <laughs> they could tell just by the way she made that tea that it's it's him that she's in love with papagane is it actually I can't even tell based on that animation. No confession made the first day. The four Ramen King series part. There's an actual part two to that. Is it more? Answer this question for me, guys. If you guys had a festival like this at your school, would you guys want to be working at a booth like this where you feel invested and just go look at the other spots on your time off? Or would you rather just be a pure visitor, you know? Oh, it's fucking Maki. You're going to steal your girl's boy here? Aren't you going to... Are you going to confess? I, I was about to say. He's telling you from personal experience. You better get on that. He's just about to say, isn't this awkward? Is, is Nagisa going to be right around the corner? What's going on? Yeah, easier said than done. I mean, it worked for them, so they're so annoying but cute at the same time, you know? <laughs> She's in hell. It's a great spot to bring a girl. Either they're into horror and they love it or they get scared and you have to protect them, you know? <laughs> or miss mood swing one of the struggles of liking your best friend's man you know I, it's, it's rough true that's a good backup shouts out maki being a good friend <laughs> you got the other three nerds just lurking trying to get their chance as well Let's go, my man. See? Heck yeah. Oh, my lord. Shouts. <laughs> I love how bright and saturated every <laughs> laser death beam. R.I.P. Maki.
Oh, oh, so it was Papagane. Okay, <laughs> okay, it was Papagane. Okay, that's funny. <laughs> oh, that's creepy as shit. She reminds me of Palm from Hunter x Hunter. Also, Ragi is scary with these stories. Oh my god. Oh my god. That is funny. Otherwise, your ears will get cut off. Come on. A 3D sound horror house. Miko Ino does always have her headphones in. She likes that ASMR. <laughs> yeah, I know. It's just stuff. Uh... Oh, so literally it was like an ASMR mic. Because I've seen those ear-shaped headphones. Or those ear-shaped like a mic. You know, what up? You know. Oh. Oh, hells no. Honestly, some good sound work. Some sound effects. I like it. I forget the job title that people have in like movies when they can make all the sound effects, you know, from just like household objects. It's crazy. She's just nibbling on your ear. <laughs> this is getting interesting. <laughs> I would never do something like that again. Or I would never do something like that. That's crazy. Oh, God. Got to do it again. That's fucked up. That's funny, though. Is that Nagisa and her man? It's got to be. <laughs> All they're doing is making out, Jesus. Nagisa ruined it? Are you serious? I'm almost as mad as Ishigami right now. Nagisa and motherfucking... Middle school student vice president. Okay, little chica sister. When he came to visit K, yep. Chica is taken back. She's aghast. Bragging. That's bragging, yep. Chica has had a plethora of bad experiences helping. Kaicho. She's adorable. She just wants him to do something that he could fail at, you know? <laughs> yeah, something he'd be innately bad at. <laughs> I like how they're playing like a carnival song. <laughs> so, this man can't do anything. But when it comes to juggling... That's actually insane. Kandama, I don't know what that is top, yo yo. He's just the master.
<laughs> Chica is so funny. This show would not be this show without Chica. I swear to God, she is so funny. And in her efforts to make it so Mohit doesn't like him, she likes him even more. She has a heart to give him a... <laughs> Around the nectar. I think her... I didn't want to say it because she's... Yeah... Mature in spirit. <laughs> now they're like loving each other about both what they like about Miyuki. I know. This is like me in anime, you know? When I, when I find someone in real life to talk about anime. You, you like that? Really? Even though she's saying that she drew curse on the floor. He's cursing her. Averted. I cannot believe they thwarted my man's plans like that. He's brooding. And it's a huge cookie. <laughs> Perfect score. <laughs> you talking about you want that cookie? We're going to win it for you. <laughs> I love this man. No, actually, would you care to split it with me? Would you like half of this cookie, ma'am? Yeah, he doesn't realize the implications of it. He just thinks it's a cookie. He doesn't realize it's a heart. He has no idea what he's saying, but that's what's giving him the confidence to say it. He has no idea. I hate. I love this and I hate this. I hope everything works out. Oh my lord. Right? You saw Ishigami giving a heart to a beautiful girl? Come on. Self-imposed restraint? What is this, Hunter Hunter? You don't worry about yourself. You literally only worry about them. That is very fact, so very true. Oh, if she says no, it will. Come on, Ishigami, it's my boy. She already has a list. <laughs> He's shy, introverted. Can totally lead to confidence. あれだけボロクソ言ってた割に優しいな。最近どれこそのせいでお口が置いた気味なだけで別に拾ってるわけじゃありませんから。天方式なら男として異性言ってる。と個人的には思ってますよ。頼むぞ石神。ここでお前が
everyone. This is like a mystery now. That darn tabletop. Mmm, I'm curious. I'm curious. Oh, these are these episodes are everything I could ask for and more. It's so Kaguya sama, like nothing has changed. Hilariosity between all of our cast. Kaguya, Ino, Ishigami, Miyuki, and Chika. And I just love how in depth they go to eat. We're having like our own little anthological stories because we're all doing different things at this festival. Kaguya being the, the waitress that she was during the coffee and ramen whole part. That was hilarious. Papagane coming to cause havoc. Ishigami uh, helping out, just kind of watching around, then asking Subame out to the horror thing only to get cucked by Nagisa and her boyfriend. <laughs> Speaking of Nagisa and her boyfriend, Maki got cucked and was helping uh, Kaguya with all. It was just, that was just all hilarious. And then, Ishigami couldn't have his alone time with her, so then she invites him to her project, and uh, obviously he's a natural at these carnival-style games. Such a killer. I mean, he was he's the son of a toy owner, right? The owner of a toy company, so it makes sense. But he won the big cookie for her. I love how he was able to finally have his confession, but because he was more along the side, he was more focused on that it was a cookie versus it being a heart, that everyone else was like, whoa, you know? So I love that. I do like how the rest of everyone's confessions are writing on Ishigami. He's like, please don't fail my boy, which Subame took that. Like she wanted a little bit of time to think about it, but she was, that was a great response. I think I'm my fingers are crossed. And then we got Chika and her sister, Moe, just absolutely hilarious. Kawi <laughs> and her reaction to that hilarious. But I love how we're finishing this out. We all have our own plan. Multiple confessions need to be made. Uh, uh, Miko Ino is working on her campfire, which I know is going to be spectacular. I am ready for it. Hopefully you guys are as well. If you are, please leave a like. Let me know your thoughts down below in those comments down below. Don't forget to subscribe. Click that bell. Check out that Patreon for early access, full length, uncut. Um, I was going to say, do I give you guys a teaser as to what's coming on the on the Patreon in the near future or, or after the show? I will tell you this, we're not going to be leaving a school environment. We're still going to be in school. That's the only teaser I'm giving you guys for the next show we're watching on the channel. Other than that, hope you guys have a wonderful day. Don't forget to drink some water, tell someone you love them. Have a great day, Dapper Squad. Peace out.